What's going on and welcome back to the RTG and in this episode today we're busy. I'm trying to get everything unlocked, SBC's packs, picks to attempt to put together our Brazilian squads and yesterday I did open one of these make your mark SBC's and when I got a German, Kessler, who's going to be handy for the following week in league when it's the German requirement. But I've got some icon SBC's coming up and well let's start off with the Elite Div rewards. But let's just send this one, 1 of 5, 92, all team of the season, Brazil. Come on, come on, just give it to me, come on! Olivier, oh, okay, okay, that's actually pretty nice. Never used him myself, but to defend against him, it's like he had quick step or whatever. Like, I don't know how he did it with his dribbling, but he really was like hard to defend against. Maybe, no, maybe no, or just no. Goalkeeper, yes, that's fantastic. Brazilian goalkeeper that I can use. Double walkout as well, that's the best pack so far, and it's Casemiro. Wow, whoa, that was a really good one. Another German, okay. Neuer, yeah, that's cool. But all of this stuff, I'm not going to be able to save from now until like the next week, weekly challenge. Nah, I'm going to have to send it all into SBCs. 87 times two. Yes! Come on, German, so German CDM. I genuinely don't know. That's good. That's why I don't know. German CDM, Oberdorf, go Brazil, 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 Brazil. Ronaldinho just showing me that hair of Desai again. And I've had him so many times. Four, four times. One Brazilian out of the three is a W. But if we could see three, that'd be even better. But just one, come on. And let it be good. USA, U USA goalkeeper. Wow, okay, that's really, really bad. Really, really bad. But it's going to be a double walkout, obviously. Campbell and Ollie Watkins. It's not what I was expecting, I'm going to be honest. I, I think that is rather low, but it's good fodder for the icon anyway. Uh, Mateo, so zero Brazilians and zero playable cards. Rank one elite div in July, and I get that. A guarantee. A guarantee of rubbish. And I'm not happy because I didn't get a single Brazilian that I can use in the weekend league. So that's why we're going for another gamble. And it's the Encore Icon player pick. And I was thinking, right, because Kafu is just so far out of the reach. Like, it's just too many coins and cards. Like, I just can't afford it. And then he's only got a few days remaining as well. So it's just impossible for me to get. We have a chance of not only receiving Rivaldo for our main team, but the Brazil one. So let's send it. Come on. It's a 103 selection as well. 91 plus Encore. You know what? Worst case scenario, we see Carlos Alberto. That is a W. Because then I can play him center back or right back, depending on where I take the team. So Carlos Alberto, absolutely. 3 2 1. The first one. Come on. Schweinsteiger, I'm going to be honest with you, boys. Say what you want. But I was so desperate one day to craft like, upgrade picks, I stuck him into an 89 exchange. That's so disrespectful considering how good Schweinsteiger was. But I'm going to have to disrespect him again. And I'm taking a Billy so I can go do another one. It is round two and it looks a little bit expensive, but it's still a 90 team. We can't get away from that. But Francescoli, I, I still haven't tried this card. Klaus, never going to use. But we're looking for the greats of the game. We're looking for that Rivaldo. It can't get much worse. The bare minimum is going to give me probably like a 94 for the cards. But one of three, team of the year, ultimate foot birthday or a great of the game. Great of the game icon, Rivaldo, right now. Change everything. Jesus Christ. No, it's happened again. It has literally happened again. How am I this bad with icons? It's not meant to be, is it? It's not meant to be. I don't know why. Like, I don't know why. I don't know. Get ready because we're going to have Tony Schweinsteiger Kessler for the weekend league next week. Now, that sounds strong. I think this year specifically, I've got the worst icon lock that I've ever received on any ultimate team RTG. It's not great. But listen, I'm going to do a little bit of a speed run. not show you every single game, but there's a brand new French Cup that's come out and it does give you that XP. And if I play a few matches, especially with this Olivier Giroud that's brand new and I want to see if he's all about that aerial plus, I'm going to be able to unlock Tony Cruz and Puskas in this episode, as well as maybe some juicy packs coming up. So, hey, you never know. Let's go. Rabiot Petit Henri. Damn, you got lucky. But Olivier Giroud supposedly is better than my Henri, I'm, I'm being told. Sorry, ball. Wow, okay, that pass though, genuinely that pass did seem a little bit glitchy from, on, from uh, sorry, Olivier Giroud to Henri there. Yes, that pass. Is that Desai? Damn! You had your moment, Desai. That would have been your first goal for the club. Lloris. All right, we match him for the goalkeeper at least. Barcola, Fakir, Usman. Considering that I missed out on the Messi as well. Well, like, not, not even like missed out. Like, I literally opened the pick and I never got a Messi. So, maybe that was just not meant to be. Oh, that's a bad pass. Oh, hold. 
Nah, look at him. Look at him. Good play. Barcola. Oh, that slice. That's actually my new favorite shot to take on. Puskas. Uh, I took the pack. No, I'm kidding. I can't even keep a straight face. I didn't take the pack. You've got to be a degenerate if you're taking that. 88 plus times five over a Puskas. Let's be real. Like, I took him, but it was harder to pick between Tony and Gerard. And I have actually tried that Gerard card. And with his high tie -high work rates, that real power that you get in drive in the midfield, like he is pretty damn good. But Tony, I did say at the start that I was going to unlock him. As soon as I saw the end of an era design with a double five star, the intercept plus, I took Tony. And considering that we do have a Germany weekend league the following week, you know, after we do the Brazilian one, it'd be really good in the midfield. So we've got some packs from the objective anyway to go and open. Let's see what we got. We might have to just send everything that we have left in this club and do... The... Oh my God, I've got an icon. Dutch! Dutch. Dutch. Oh my God, nah, boys. Dutch Rijkaard. 55,000 coins, by the way. 55k doesn't even sell what is going on they've got to be trolling at this point dutch you're gonna give me dutch and the only other two players Hullet and cruyff that hurts that really really does but rykard i've always liked on the game especially with his tackling so i wanted to bring him into our elite like session we're gonna grind a few games and then with the joe gomez upgrade i believe ea made a mistake and they gave him Quick Step Plus, and he shouldn't have even receive that. But hey, it is what it is. It's a free upgrade for me. But Tony in there, Puskas, like we've got some cool cards. So just fingers crossed that they perform. It's basically like a brand new team that we've got right now. Ronald Koeman. But they sweat out his price range again. Well, he's got to be at least like 500k with how he looks. We're not shutting down the midfield in this game. Oh my goodness me. We're not shutting down the midfield. We're letting him get through too easily. Puskas, wonderful. Puskas, Puskas. What a ball. Puskas pass. Tony. Tony. Rafinha. Yo, through. Puskas. Chip. Chip. I'm on side. Calm. Omri. 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 Wow. Don't know. A bit sketchy, though, from Pedicek there. Like, he didn't even move. He just literally stood in, like, the worst possible position. Yeah, he's got lovely jockey in Rijkaard. That's maybe why you like him so much. And for 50,000 coins as well, this might be an actual bargain. Puskas finesse shot. Oh. Great tackle. That wonderfully timed. Bora. Puskas. Yeah, I don't know what was up with the first one. It's all right. It's all right. He's back in it, boys. No, I lost that engagement. And he's going to score. Whoa, Puskas. Okay, what the hell? Maldini. Can we get you? Puskas Omri R9. Maldini, I want you. Nah, the back-to-back -back blocks. What well on, Rijkaard, though. He is feeling all right. Tony got lucky. Through ball, come on. Come on, Puskas. Quick, quick step plus. Where is it? It should show it above his head. Puskas finesse. Yes, come on. He's going to have to be good. Is a 98 rated Puskas. Come on. Well done, Xavi. I do prefer Xavi, though, as my right forwards. I think I'm going to change that. Like, go back to him. I'm using this Rafinha right now, and I, I don't know, like... He's going to be fine for a challenge, but in a build like this, nah, I don't think I should really be using him. Over top. Yes. Come on, Puskas, take that touch. Knee post it. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. Nah, that's actually so unlucky. Come on, Puskas. Yes, all yours. All yours. Xavi. Bissek Kanate. Erlen, like, worst player to face. Over the top. Puskas. Come on, just control it quickly. What a ball. Get in there, Xavi. But yeah, we need to get that touch a little bit earlier so then I can try and do something with it. Head it on. Puskas press proven. Through. Little extra pass. Why not? Why not be cheeky? Let it drop. Let it drop. Nice pass. Come on, Puskas. Just let me roll this defender. Wonderful dribbling. Even though it felt a little bit heavy. Yeah, go on, Foden. Henri, that was swift. Puss gas. Come on, four goals. More like it. Any crazy cards? Mickey van der Ven. Don't know if he was a worthwhile SBC. Well, my, I, I just want Casillas back. Wow. Okay, that was crazy, crazy. 
Puskas. Oh, no, that was extra dribbling. That was really, really smooth. Oh. Mickey, 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 you got no composure. I'll be real. Every time I come up against Mickey van der Ven, the opponent has done something weird with him. I remember nutmegging him in foot champs as well. So I did settle for this team in the end. I made a couple of tweaks in the midfield. And the Enzo, this was the first time using him after his upgrades. And I must say that he does feel a lot better than I remembered him to be. And also uh, with the Fernando Torres, he was given like 99 pace or whatever. And I felt like yesterday when I was using him, he's an absolute beast now. Like he's finishing pace. Like he does feel a lot better in game. So if you've got him in your club, I recommend testing him out. And with the Puskas... It's not all like happy days with him. I'm going to be honest. Like it's still a very, very good card here with his quick step feel, his pace. Like he is zippy and he's got like good finishing in general. But you've got to be careful because that shot doesn't seem like a, a 99 finish all the time. Like some of the finesses, even for my opponents, I've been noticing like a couple of shots that they pull wide. So yeah, keep in mind with that Puskas. Like it is a little bit odd because I've always associated Puskas with like pure consistent finishing, but maybe it is a little bit of user error as well from my part and the opponents. But yeah, I just noticed that in a few games because the shot from Henri outside the box, that finesse is more consistent than Puskas. I'll say that for a fact, but he's still a very good card and he's fun and I'm very pleased I took him. I mean, he's not yet rated Puskas. And Tony, it is solid. Yeah, I tried him out as a middle center mid, tried him out as a left center mid. I'm, I'm going to be real though, his performance hasn't really been as good as when I first used the road to the final loan on my other account. Like when I brought that one into my midfield with the interceptions and stuff, I thought, wow, like he really did transform my side. But this one here, I I'm sure that he has that ability. I just haven't unlocked it yet uh, for whatever reason. But then again, I am coming up against some sweaty opponents. So it's not going to be that easy, right? In the elite div, especially at this stage of the game. And Rijkaard was a surprisingly good performer. Genuinely, like he felt very good with his interceptions. Uh, his jockey was smooth as well. Like I really did enjoy Rijkaard. I'm going to be real. I think for 50,000 coins as well, you can't go wrong. And that jockey does feel pretty damn good on him. So great play styles and the anticipate as well. Just a shame he doesn't have any aerial or any power header. But then the pace split is beautiful. Reactions, composure 99. Like seriously, trust, test him out. He's literally 40, 50K. So you can see if you like him yourself. But overall, I am happy that I've taken Tony Cruz. Um, I think Puskas is going to be a little bit of a beast. But I'll be real, boys. I'll, I want to do the Brazilian objective. Uh, let me just show you all my Brazilians right now. But I got like 150k and I still need to work towards the Joel Linton Evo. So I don't even know when I'm going to start playing the weekend league. I'm going to be real. Like I don't know what to do. These are all my Brazilians right now. Yeah, feels bad. But anyway, I'll sort it out and I'll see you guys on the next one whenever we do our champ speed run. So is it going to be the Brazilian team? Is it going to be my main squad? You're going to have to find out. But thank you so much for watching and yeah, go and, go and unlock these cards. Just get your XP, get Tony, get Puskas and enjoy. Bye-bye for now. Peace.